love so I have created this Diwali makeup look for you guys and it is coming around the corner so I've already started with my brows done and here I'm just priming my eyelids with the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer in Medium Dark Warm. I'm going to be using the Zoeva Cocoa Blend Eyeshadow Palette and I'm using the shade called Bitter Start to set that base and that's going to be our base colour anyways. I then grab the Makeup Geek eyeshadow in Preppy just above this into my crease and use this as my transition shade. I'm just using Windshield Wiper Motions. And then I'm using the eyeshadow called Dragonfly by Makeup Geek as well and I'm really using this on the outer third of my eyelid. And I did bring it into the crease a bit and I believe this is a Morphe brush that I'm using and I'll try and find which one it is and write it in the info box. I then used a clean fluffy brush just to clean up the edges and make sure that everything was blended and then I'm grabbing the NYC black liquid eyeliner just to create a simple wing. Just a tip when you're doing eyeliner, just take your time and if you mess up you can always clean it up with a makeup wipe, touch up with some eyeshadow and then try it again. And then I'm going to be grabbing a makeup wipe and cleaning the wing up and making it look really sharp and clean. Once I've done that, I'm going to be using the Mario Badescu Aloe Vera Aloe Rose Water Facial Spray. I never remember the name, but I'm just going to spritz this all over my face. And then I'm going to be using the Sleek Illuminator in Monaco and just kind of applying this on my skin just to add in extra moisture. I'm really sorry, someone's like cutting the grass and it's really annoying me, but I need to do this voiceover. Um, I'm using the Bobbi Brown or uh, not Orange, Dark Peach corrector around my mouth area and I really like this because it's extra full coverage and it does the job really well even though it's not like the brightest orange that I usually do use but it does the job really well and then I'm using the NARS Shea Glow Foundation in Tahoe and blending this all over my skin and for concealer I'm going to be using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC42 and blending this all out with my damp beauty blending sponge to set that concealer I'm using the Ultra Contour Palette by Makeup Revolution and just lightly setting that in place then for bronzer I am using the NYX matte bronzer in the shade deep and then I'm also grabbing the NYX uh, pro contour and highlight palette and I'm grabbing these two cool tone brown shades just to um, chisel those cheekbones a bit because I have really round cheeks this just really helps to give extra definition to my face and then I'm going to be using the new sleek uh, Cleopatra's Kiss highlighting palette and I'm grabbing Sphinx I believe and I'm just highlighting my skin I highlighted my cheekbones my nose my my temples and a bit on my cupid's bow as well and I'm kind of mixing some of the shades and highlighting my inner corner as well and I also decided to highlight my brow bone as well because I feel like I need to go overboard with this palette. It's just so fun to use. And in here I am not really contouring but just adding a bit of definition to my nose and I use the NYX um, Pro Contour and Highlight Palette. For my eyes I'm going in with the Maybelline Colour Show Cold Pencil in the shade 520 which is called Green and I'm just lining my waterline with this it's super bright and pigmented and it doesn't budge so these are like really good quality and then I'm going to be curling my eyelashes before applying my false eyelashes and I'm using the classy lashes UK mink lashes in Claudia just popping those on and there you go they're so easy to put on and use and you can wear these for like 25 times and I have a coupon code for you guys at, which will be in the info box if you guys are interested. And then here I'm using the MAC Lip Pencil in Well and then going in with the Gerald Cosmetics Hydro Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Sure. And it really complements the turquoise on the eyes so... I really like this look so that's the end of this makeup tutorial if you guys want to see more like these let me know subscribe for more videos i love you guys and i will see you next time bye